Guns N' Roses frontman Axl Rose has been sued by a woman who alleges he sexually assaulted her more than 30 years ago in New York. She alleged the encounter happened after she was invited back to Axl Rose's hotel room with another model. Uh, she claims that Axl Rose became infuriated with her. She says he waited outside of her, the restroom while she was using it. She says that he then forced himself upon her. She says he flew into a fit of rage, and she says that they had a non-consensual encounter after that that was violent and aggressive. Axel Rose, through his attorney, has denied the allegations. Rose's attorney said, simply put, this incident never happened. Notably, these fictional claims were filed the day before the New York State filing deadline expires. Though he doesn't deny the possibility of a fan photo taken in passing, Mr. Rose has no recollection of ever meeting or speaking to the plaintiff and has never heard about these fictional allegations prior to today, Mr. Rose is confident the case will be resolved in his favor. The story says the suit claims that Kennedy experienced PTSD-like symptoms after the alleged incident when she hears Rose's name or Guns N' Roses music. She further claims that she suffered from anxiety and depression since the alleged assault and that trauma compromised her career. The suit listed assault, battery, inten intentional infliction of emotional distress and gender-motivated violence as his causes of action, asking for an unspecified damages to be determined by the court. We'll keep you posted on any updates from this story and more. Subscribe here at Rockfeed for the latest news and updates.